Okay, that, that doesn't look like safe right here. This looks like no man's land. Let's move forward. Yep. Um. Um. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Metro Last Layer on PS4. Okay, um, in the last video, we've actually beginning to see some light at the end of the tunnel because after going through the shit storms of being captured and getting shot at a whole lot, um, we've actually rejoined our group, which is, involves like Miller, um, Anna, his, I think Anna's his daughter, and um, we don't actually know who else is around in this church that we've come to. I know Anna's there because we just started speaking to her. So let's um, jump in and see if we can give the guys some more intel on what we know about the Dark Ones. So here we go. I didn't take you seriously before, but Hunter, he read you right from the start. He put his trust in you. It took me time. I didn't understand until I saw you in action, and I almost got you killed. <laughs> You don't make this easy for me, Artyom. I'll stop for now. Go on and get ready. The guys are coming soon and we're all going to Aktyabrskaya. How'd you say that place name? Aktyabrskaya. I don't know... <laughs> Who came up with the name of that word? Okay, so... In this church as well, it doesn't, I don't know how that makes any sense, but we don't need our gas mask anymore. Even though there's like big open doors and windows, the oxygen seems to be flowing in here. So, um, let's see who we've got in this church. She said that the other guys are coming, so I'm guessing that, like, Miller and the others aren't here yet. We... By the way, a traveling gun merchant stopped here for the night, so you could take a look at his merchandise. That's a great idea, girly. I could really do with buying some, um, filters if they sell them. Okay, this guy sells ammo. So let's stock up on... Shop. Shut up. Yep, yeah, yeah, you made it yourself. Okay, we may as well stock up completely. Stop talking, mate! You're in my ear! Oh, you know, that's loud. Sorry, guys. Um, this guy's selling guns. We don't need to sell guns or buy guns because um, I'm pretty happy, pretty happy with the weapons that we're using. Have you ever been to the catacombs? Mm. She's talking to me. Look at this guy's armor. Look at that. That's a weird shape, isn't it? Alright, so, um,. We're stocked up on ammunition now. I've got a feeling though, you know, even though we got the silent shotgun weapon, um, it's only got one shot per magazine, one shell you can fit in the clip. And I feel like we're gonna go into a big, heavy firefight right now. Okay, someone's knocking on the door. I should have been like a mutant just standing there. Rod block. Rod block. That's an old one. Up there. I know that voice. Shit, I can't place it. Wait a minute. Could it be Lesnitsky? <laughs> Holy shit! Who's Lesnitsky? Le Lesnitsky. Is he a former friend turned bad guy? Okay, this isn't good. Shit, Anna. Is she gonna get shot? You damn traitor. Anna, what a surprise. I'm no traitor. I never served you in the first place. We'll take this one back. No! That's it. Move! Okay, so I managed to hide from all that chaos. Looks like Anna's been taken hostage. Time for her to take a feel of what it's like to be a hostage. <laughs> Other than me. Okay, so we're in a burning building. Um, all that's blocked off now. There's a dead guy on the floor. Let's have reload the weapon. Um, just seen they're gonna loot that guy. He's got nothing on him. So let's move forward. Probably. So we're a lone wolf once again. I thought we were gonna be in a big group now because we've rejoined our camp, you know. But it looks like we're staying on our own again. Cause can you turn his lights off? Let me just check. Here yeah, you can. So even though this is our like hideout, they've taken over now. Let's see what we've got. There's gonna be some guys around here somewhere. Okay, this is still um, where all the place is burning down. There's a tape recorder there. Okay, 
Okay. We're down in the basement. There's an entrance to the catacombs, leading to Akdai Praskaya. That guy can't say that word either. So they're traitors, and they've taken Anna to Arkchebroyeskia. <laughs> I don't think even if I learned how to say that word properly, I still wouldn't be able to say it. You know. All right. So um, they said that tape recording said that they took Anna down through the basement, and that's this way. What weapon's that? It's like an um, assault rifle. It looks like I've already got one, and it's pretty decent. So I'll keep a hold of this one. Put the flashlight on. Get a feeling that um, um, RTM is going to start gasping soon. Oh, 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 hello. Uh, what's this? Whoa, what is that? My light went off. I'm... When I try and turn my flashlight on, guys, this happens? See that inter interference? I don't know, it's weird. Fuck. Let's get that on. Is a... Can we light? Is that a torch or a lever? It's like, a, it's like a torch that's not that's not lit. So let me try and yeah, you can't turn your flashlight on. That happens. So there's some weapon on the ground there. There's like a shotgun. I keep a hold of the one I've got because it, <coughs> I can be stealth with it. So there's a dead guy there on the ground. Hello. I would like to turn my flashlight on. So there's like, there's just some bodies there then. I'm sure there were people standing. Oh yep. Um, that's not real. I'm starting to lose my shit again. So there must be dark ones in the area, like, interfering with my brain here. That's normally what happens when um, our team starts to see shit like that. Just picked up a claymore there. Let me just quickly check on what weapons we've got equipped. Um, let's go for molotovs for the moment, because they can kill stuff quickly, can't they? So there's definitely, like, ghosts here. Are they ghosts or what? I don't even know what they are. Okay. It's going weird again. Turn this guy's corpse over a bit. Pick up whatever's on him. That's a lot of bats. Let's pick up this knife. I think we're full on knives, actually. So it looks like we're getting in this very unstable looking um, lift thing, whatever it is. It's like a hot air balloon. You know, the, the, the uh, basket. Okay, I'm going to get the rifle out here, just I feel a bit safer holding this in my hand, instead of a pistol. So my flashlight's working again. Um, let's just shoot that. Whoa, one shot kill, nice. Um, get off. Get off, please. <laughs> oh my god. This is nuts! Oh god, I'm not enjoying this. So, obviously I'm going to take as minimal amount of shots as possible. Maybe I should use this. Yeah, that's a one-shot kill. Because i got so many ammo for this weapon, so I may as well use this to save the assault rifle ammo. Alright, where are they? There we go. Um. Um. I'm out of control. Okay. I'm, I think I was meant to be square. That usual thing of not knowing what to do. you got to spam square. Because obviously it's playing a major hardcore, guys. It doesn't tell you when you're meant to press mash a button to get out of like a quick time event. I've got to do it again. Bollocks. Alright, guys. I have to do that whole section again. Just shooting these. This time I'm going to spam square. That should aim. Um, yeah, look at this. Get a knife out this time. So there we go. The game's like very loud on this. Like some sections are really quiet and then it's just the noise blast. I can't even, can't even hear myself speak. So um, let's heal ourselves up with a medikit. We've only got one left there after this one. So there was some damage we couldn't help but take there because there was that many of them, I feel. I'm like, you kind of lose control of the character anyway. So we're uh, going deeper and deeper. Did they come this way? Surely they didn't. If there's that many mutants, like... Okay, so let's, um... Let me just turn the sound up, actually, because I can't hear it now. Okay, I can hear that. That's loud. Um... 
I'm just avoiding this thing, this water, because it doesn't look too safe. Keeping the silence weapon out for now because um, I haven't been detected. Um, okay, they've run off. Maybe we should turn the flashlight off. Yeah, let's do that. I don't know how much mutants can see flashlights or how they're affected by them. I think humans are. There's a torch there. Turn it off. Look like they were attracted by that light there on the helmet, so maybe they are guided towards the light. That sounds like a big monster. Those footsteps. we just done a boss fight in the last um, video, so I hope there's not another one coming up right now. There we go. I'll let them do their own thing. You can still hear loads of footsteps. There's local how many there are. So I'm like definitely in their like their home right here. Their little uh It's like a stampede. <gasps> Holy shit! Okay, is that all that's left? Because it seemed like they were running across for ages right there. Okay, so let me just check the journal. It tells us to go the other way. It's a little quick inspect, see if there's anything we can pick up here. That actually could be useful. No, there's nothing really there, so um we really need to get some filters as well if we do have to go outside again. Because before we went inside the church, I literally had no more oxygen left in my gas mask. It was like empty. I was gasping for breath before we went in the church. So, um, if we do have to go outdoors again, I really need filters. Okay, this guy is turning around to look at me. Shit, he hit me. Uh, I was hoping to get him as close as possible before hitting me so I could just get a one-shot kill, but I didn't think he'd jump on me. I thought he was going to jump before me. So, um, that's not too bad. We didn't take too much damage, actually. Let's just check all these corners. Oh, shit! Um, <laughs> I shot my gun thinking that... Oh, I don't even know what this happened. That wasn't fun. Let me just, how many health kits have I got left? I've got two, okay. I think health kits heal you to full, so if I'm like on 80% health, I may as well wait to like go down to like 20 before wasting it, you know? It seems like every time you use a health kit, you do go to like full health. There's no flashing on the screen or anything, you know? Oh no. No. Whoa, shit, come on. Um. Um. What the hell? Stab it, stab it in the face, stab it in the face. Run away a bit, run away, heal. Okay, let's reload as well now. Turn round. Oh my god, I didn't kill any of them. Come on, die please. Holy shit. Could do with getting some headshots there, but they were, took like 10 bullets each to kill then. It wasn't good. So that was like a little bit of ambush while we head towards this next next um, objective. It's like machine gun there. What is that? That looks like a fire shotgun shells. What is that? Let me just look at this. Holy shit! Whoa! I pressed L2 there and he just started shooting. That's a powerful weapon. Um, I'm gonna keep a hold of what I've got though. I I, I can't let go with this um. This pistol that I use, because it's just so nice, there is. You know, if something works, keep it. That's what I that's how I feel. Even though like it's not the best weapon in a lot in some circumstances, it is good for stealthing. So let's hold square on this. I think I've got to keep hold of square because I Tapped it. Right, let's go. Make sure the weapons are all loaded. A lot of, oh my god, look how many there are. Maybe I should have got that weapon. <laughs> I'm sure we'll be okay with this. So, can we jump in this? It's not letting me use it. Oh, there we go. I have to grab the top handle. What is this device? So, it looks like there's some kind of mining getting done here. They've got like all mine carts and, you know, scaffolding and stuff. Okay, so let's um, take it slow to start before we get detected. There seems like there's going to be a lot down there though. 
Hopefully we can stealth this to some degree. You know, thin the numbers first before we do get spotted. Okay, there's one over there eating. Let's um So they're just running around just for the fun of it. They're not actually running towards me. Just yet. Um whoa, hello. So obviously I'm gonna stay in the darkness as well. Like if you look at my wristwatch guys, there's a little light on my on my next to the watch. It's turned off at the moment, but it turns blue when you're in the light. You're able to be detected. So I'm gonna shoot this one, I think. Yeah, they did they weren't aware of that. That's good. So let's stay around the outside. Let's check any corpses we see of um, humans. Obviously, there's no point checking mutant corpses because they don't have pockets. <laughs> so, we're making our way past these guys. There's a health kit on that body there because they were getting that. Let's kill this one up here first, then we might make our way back down. So, that one's dead. Let's get this one now. It's not dead, it's not dead. Shit. Okay, so we're okay still. I don't think we've alerted too many. So we got a, we got a health pack from that guy. Although we took damage while trying to get it. Although we probably got something else useful as well, like um, ammo. This guy was eating a corpse, wasn't he? No, it's, it's not on that guy. So let's keep on moving slowly. Kind of in the light here, which isn't good. See so the way the light's gone on blue now? That means I've been spotted. So, uh, shit, they definitely spotted me there. Because uh, I was in the light and he made an, a noise. So I'm getting the louder weapon out. I think this is a loud weapon, I'm not too sure. It looks like a silencer on the end, but it might just be a muzzle flash. Which doesn't count as a silencer. But I'm not 100% sure. It sounds like a silencer too, so I don't know. Okay, it looks like we haven't been spotted. So we're gonna... Okay, shit. So let's... Uh, that one's got us back to this one. So if we shoot this, whoa, he <laughs> went flying. Let's get this one now. Been spotted there for sure. Okay, took them out. I think there's one more still, yep. Get them headshots on him. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that is, I can't tell. It sounds in between like a silencer and a loud weapon. It's hard to tell if it is properly a silencer, you know? So let me just check my uh, my email health kits because I may have full. No, I've got four. So I'm gonna I'm not gonna heal just yet. If we get five hit health kits, I heal that way we can pick up more. Because five is the limit. So um, there's some bodies around here. That's full. We have, we can't carry any more um, incendiaries. I feel like I'm gonna get ambushed here because it's like at the end of the line. So we'll probably call a lift and then there'll be loads of enemies coming in. So let's get ourselves a full HP to give ourselves more of a chance of not getting killed. So we're jumping on this lever thing. Lever, whatever you want to call it. I've loaded it. What is it? Is it a lift? Elevator? Okay, yep, yeah, of course. Ambush. Let's try our grenades. That's a bad grenade. Um, to get some distance. Heal up a bit. Oh god. I think grenades were pretty bad. The problem with grenades is they take a little bit of time to throw. You can't get like an instant throw on it. Ow. 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 <laughs> Shit. Didn't even see them. actually not a bad grenade there. I think I got three of them with that one. So let's just stay behind the fire. Hopefully they'll run into it. Are they burning? It's hard to tell. Oh god, I'm stuck in the corner. Shit, that's not good. Um, I have to wait for this fire to go out now. There's a lot of um, noise going on now. I'm also on my last clip on the Auto rifle, the assault rifle. Because I can't reload it anymore, so I'm not sure how many bolts you've actually got inside this. Let's pick up that Molotov there. 
He should have really picked up the shotgun that was here somewhere and swapped it back to the other one. Okay, let me just check the... Um, got two incendiaries left. They're pretty good because the actual grenades that explode, they take ages to throw and explode and kill, you know? Because you can take ages to throw it, and then once you've thrown it, it ticks for like three seconds. So we actually did get through that in some kind of not too bad fashion. But we are low on auto. Um, I keep going to auto rifle, assault rifle ammo. And this weapon is not good in a um, high action env environment. It's good for stealth, it's amazing for stealth, but when they're all chasing you down, it's, just a, it's so weak. It's very situational. So hopefully this lift thing doesn't crash and fall apart and drop us back down to the bottom. Okay, this is made our way out here at the top. No way did all these um, people that have captured Anna come all the way through here. Or maybe they did. There's some dead bodies here. <laughs> Think, thinking about it now. Okay, that, that doesn't look like safe right here. This looks like no man's land. Let's move forward. Yep. Um. Um. Fall down, one fall down. What is this? This is a new enemy, this. Hang on, hang on. Climb up. Come on. No shit. Are we gonna fight this? Are we seriously fighting this? I think you've gotta crush these same um, crap shit. <laughs> I feel like you've gotta make these fall. Um Maybe we make him charge into them. That's it, yeah, you just charge into some. So I stand behind it. It's kinda like a I don't know what you call it. There's a fight in Arkham Asylum, I think. That's like this, where you fight the Rhino guy. You have to make him run into stuff. So he's running through that one, hitting that one. Now if I stand behind this one, this this last one now. So what happens here, I don't know. Okay, that's fallen. Now what? Now what do I do? Do I make him run through this? Nice, yes. Okay, that, that was pretty good. Where did he go though? <laughs> that actually went very well for like what you meant to do. I did it first time. <laughs> Experience. <laughs> okay, so what have we just done there? Why did we reload that weapon? Can you open this? It looks like you can. Yeah, definitely. I keep reloading the weapon and it's like not full. Let's see, it looks like I'm picking up like one bullet at a time and it's just adding one bullet to the clip, which isn't isn't much really. So, because they give us ammo right there, you feel like they're going to throw a, um, a combat section into you. Do you know what? I think I'm going to make the jump now and... Shit, I can't get back up. Oh, I was going to get the... Oh, no, there wasn't a shotgun there, was it? It was a rifle. Okay. Here's the big guy. And there's also minions. He's not dead. He's just pissed off. Oh, two shots already and he's not dead. Come on. He's still alive, I think. That's nuts. Okay, so make a run for it a little bit. Get some distance. There's also more boulders to run into here for this guy. So let's guide him through these again. Which looks like that one's up there. Let's get the rifle out for the the ads that come in. So he's knocked that pillar down over there. I think this is a pillar as well we need to knock down. He's knocking these. There's loads of pillars, like one, two, three there, and there's four. So just kick, kick it. as long as I'm behind these pillars, you should run into them instead of me. Right, he's knocking the walls down now as well. That's not good. I think this is a pillar I need to knock down. It's not even worth shooting him because I just know that's not going to work. He looks very armoured, you know. So um, there's a pillar over here. Whoa! Oh, that was close. A bit close for comfort. Okay, so we've got, I think it's only these two pillars left now, actually. No, there's one here as well. Okay, get behind this one. As long as he makes, as soon as he makes a move, I need to run. Because he's going to go through that, isn't he? Oh, shit, he got me. Um, Run, just for a sec. Oh, my God. <laughs> Heal up a bit. Because it's splashing quite a bit there. Okay, so there's a pillar on the other side to, my, to the left. Over here. This one. Need to get this one smashed. Where is he? He's over there. I think that's in there. Do I need to knock down these like 
bricks as well. So it's right there. Shit, make a move. I think I might need to take these walls down as well. I'm not sure. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think we've got to take everything down, actually, because it's all supporting the ceiling, you know? So, yeah, I think these, this stuff as well. Oh, fuck that. Come on. No way that he hit me. Why is he walking now? He's not charging anymore. Oh, shit. <laughs> I jumped a bit there. <laughs> Any more pillars? There's a um, thingy here. A wooden one. Oh, shit. <laughs> one shot to the head he's dead. I think he took a shield off him when he's running through all that stuff. <laughs> pop, pop. Imagine if that was all he had to do the whole time. <laughs> Oh shit, it's falling apart now. Let's get out of here. I don't think we can. Shit, water. Um, yeah, it's going to raise a bit, I think, isn't it? And we can... Yeah, there we go. Get in. Um, drowning. Spam square, spam square. Spam square. <laughs> Oh, where are we going? Are we going down? We're going deeper, aren't we? Oh, that was lucky. Ow. On your face. Holy shit, that was eventful. I can't, did I die through all that? I don't think I died once. All the roads lead to Octavraskaya. The Dark One is there. Anna is there now too. In the hands of my enemies. The hands of the traitor, Lesnitsky. Looks like we're heading towards the end of the game soonish. If I think that Archibrevyaska um, is the end, <laughs> um, probably going to be the end of the game where you're going to have to have to find Anna. I think there may be alternate endings in this. I'm not sure where you have to either choose Anna or the Dark One. Maybe uh, we'll see in the next video. Anyway, either way. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.